you share with us what is your background and what is your role in this county? I have. A, I was a director of a 24-hour suicide prevention line for 24 years, and then uh, three years ago, I was uh, appointed the uh, mental health director. There was a divided board, and uh, and then within nine months, our board merged, the mental health board and the uh, Addis board merged, and now I'm the director of the Mahoning County Mental Health and Recovery Board. And you're my main contact for stepping up in your county. And we visited you like in spring of this year and you've done some really wonderful things. Share just a couple things you've done that have changed how you operate. Well, I think one of the positive things about Mahoney County is when the boards merged, Brenda Heidinger, who is the director of the Mental uh, Recovery Board, became the associate director. So now we're a team. So we you basically have two directors here. and. Uh, when I was at a meeting with Tracy Plock and the other mental health directors, she had talked about the stepping up, and it was in the very early stages. On the way back from uh, Columbus, I get called my office that the Mahoning County Commissioners were going to pass a resolution, so they were on it from a meeting they had gone earlier, I think, with you. So it was pretty exciting. We called a group together, and I think we, in a short time we got about 24 people in a room, and so we started working with uh, the sheriff. And we had done some things in the jail, but I think the Stepping Up Initiative gave us the, uh, the initiative to work with, with the jail, the justice system, and some, some neat innovative ways. We're starting to work with recovery coaches and peers when people start to leave the jail to reduce the recidivism rate. I think Mahoney County has been a leader and we use some of our central pharmacy money and we give it to the jail as an allocation. And they are able to get the newest and the latest formularies so people um, can use the same medication that come out and that has had a major effect on recidivism. It's, it's been a very positive. So you have really done a lot of partnering with other agencies, sheriffs, criminal justice to make, uh, to reduce the population of persons with mental illness in the jail and that's where you have made some real changes? We're absolutely, in fact the person that oversees the stepping up is Anna Diasenis, who's the exec, who is the administrator who works and the, for the county commissioner, she's over the grants. And so her in that role, and then we have the treatment people in there, the sheriff's department, uh, community corrections, we're all at the table and we're all working as a team. And we kind of share ideas and it's been very positive. And now we're trying to get additional grants. Well, I want to thank you and your county for your leadership. You have been shining stars. You have shown that a small county without many resources can really make a difference. So thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah.